Mike Perlack here to entertain you on this uh, <clears throat> camera phone on top of a tripod. Well, it is a, it is still a tripod by definition, but it's held together by duct tape. <clears throat> I'll have to give you a visual to show you what exactly I'm talking about. There's my tripod. <laughs> Held together by duct tape. <laughs> I have a new one somewhere. <laughs> I just, I'm still unpacking since I moved. <laughs> but anyways. <laughs> yeah, did you see that black woman destroy <laughs> Bill Maher on his show? Um, I wish I could tell you I saw it over the weekend or, or Friday night when uh, or Saturday morning right, when I watch them. Uh, real time with Bill Maher. Yeah, black woman destroyed Bill Maher. And normally I can watch his, his uh, uh, real time with Bill Maher on uh, YouTube. But for some reason, that one, I couldn't. It's still, it's, last time I looked, it's still not available on his YouTube, uh, uh, real time YouTube channel. So. <laughs> but the black woman destroyed Bill Maher. I don't know who the black woman is, but I'll tell you who she's not. She's not Kamala Harris, because Kamala Harris is not a black woman. <laughs> Despite what uh, the Democratic Party want you to think. <laughs> uh, even when I don't work my second job, I, I, I had to do my shopping and, and taking care of business and everything tonight. But I had to go to the hardware store and get the uh, deck correct, because I'm still uh, in the process of incrementally staining my deck. But, uh, yeah, I made that short with uh, Kamala Harris, you know, uh, um, yeah, she, w she wouldn't do anything different that, uh, that Joe Biden, <laughs> uh, um, did Every everything, uh, um, that he did, she would have done exactly the same. So I guess, uh, but I, I think that she would have done worse that uh, instead of just 13, American soldiers perishing, I think if Kamala was president at that time, it would have been 30. So that's how great her leadership is. So so uh, good for Amer legal American citizens. Yeah, Kamala Harris is so good for legal American citizens, isn't she? The elitist powers that be, Democratic Party especially, has been able, allowed to walk around for 30 plus years like their shiat don't stink. And now, <laughs> they don't know what to do. That's why they're destroying themselves. Every, every word that comes out of that woman's mouth on, on a public platform, whether it's a view or wherever, <laughs> she's just pro affirming what we all, what the, what uh, anybody with half a brain knows. She's a moron. <laughs> she's like the, the person that didn't, didn't do the homework in school. That, that's Kamala Harris, right there. The one who didn't do her homework in school. I don't want this to be too long. There's just going to be another video journal entry, I guess. But, yeah, when I need uh, <clears throat> when I need to watch something to give me hope and inspiration, <laughs> yeah, I, I, I'll watch a, a video of a, of, a, of a lecture or a, a interview with uh, Thomas Sowell. You don't know who Thomas Sowell is? Well, I'm not surprised because the leadership powers to be, they don't want you to know who Thomas Sowell is. So uh, do yourself a favor and look him up. Thomas Sowell. S-O-W-E-L-L. -L. Thomas Sowell. Yeah. Um, uh, uh, awesome gentleman. Uh, an uh, economist. Uh, writer. Um, uh, but uh, yeah, that's that's who I turn to when I need hope with all this uh, BS going on in our our, our uh, world right now. You know, it's funny. <clears throat> Back when I uh, had I had my head up my own arse and I supported I supported Obama. I honestly thought he would do stuff, and I and I and I'd be like, uh, oh. Oh wow! This is so wonderful. He—it's like I'm president. <laughs> With the decisions that Obama uh, made, it just goes to show how uh, how uh, um, duped I was <clears throat> politically and so socially, socially and politically by the powers that be. 
No, I, I used to think uh, that, yeah, I'm just like Obama. No, nope, I'm nothing like Obama. I, uh, much as I probably hate to admit it, I'm actually more like Trump, I guess. All right, <laughs> that'll do it for now. Mike Perlack, thank you for your time.